We are here in Gdańsk for the Connect Europe project for the Solidarity chapter because we believe that there is no better place in Europe to talk about the solidarity than to talk about it here when the solidarity movement actually started and when the peaceful revolution and peaceful movement in the continent uh, started. One of the most important demands today when we think about solidarity is just to find spaces where we can exercise being together, trusting each other, cooperating. I mean, we have to face today such a complex and complicated problems that only through cooperation and trust we can try to solve them. Solidarity as a concept, uh, for me it's um, unity, it's teamwork uh, and it's acceptance of other people. Solidarity can help in daily life because when you understand other people, you have more power. Uh, when you don't think about only about yourself, but about other and about uh, struggles of other people in this group, you have more power than as an individual with your own, your own point of view. Solidarity means action. Uh, solidarity means uh, when you come together and do something that is hard to overcome, uh, what rights do you have and fighting for them when they're not given to you and fighting not only for yourself but for other people to have rights as well. Nowadays we see that there has been a lot of rapid changes uh, on European continent, in European Union and beyond and we need solidarity to respond to those challenges and we can only respond to them if we act in unity, if we if we act solidar with solidarity, and this is very important uh, for socio-economic problems that we face, but also for the uh, problems with climate and so many others. So solidarity is the key answer to many challenges that we face nowadays in Europe. Solidarity is a political expression of love. Together we stand, divided we fall.